Hello everyone. Welcome to today's episode of the daily target series. Let's begin with today's target. With a glance, it looks like it would take around four to five divs to complete it. So let's begin. First, as always, we'll write body, then we'll give it the background color. Ow. Okay, I was thinking that why isn't the suggestions appearing, but now I know. <laughs> I'll just run background clip first. Ow. Background. And I'll just copy this color from here, paste. Now what we'll do is display flex. Justify content center. And align items center. You would be wondering why am I centering it now? The re reason is e extremely simple. Like I am going to make this div larger. Like this first div, second div, third div would be inside a fourth div which I would just rotate at 45 degrees. So the work would be quite less. So obviously I'm going to name them as per the English alphabets. So div A. Let's make the video shorter by copying and pasting it rather than writing it manually. So paste, paste and paste. So B, C, D. By the way, I think the size is exactly what we need for the C div, which is the brown one. So I'll simply write C here. And I'll take the color from here. So paste. Now, as you can see that all three divs are inside the A div. So what I would simply do is A. I'll give it a width of what should be the width? 500 pixels. Okay, and a height of like you can see it's 100 by 100. This square is 100 by 100. So I'll go for 300. Like three of them have equal height. So if we do the addition, it should be 300 pixels. So that's it for the aid. No, wait, we have to add one more thing, which is transform. And the transform has a rotate property at 45 degrees. Ignore what happened to the square. Now we have to give similar properties to both B and D. Like they do not have any different properties. So I'll just straight away go with this method. Now the height we require is 100 pixels. And the background color. Background we require is also same. So V. There is a little bit difference which we'll tackle afterwards. First, let me bring that to the inside. Like, let me see if this works. No, it doesn't. I was thinking of simply putting display flex and bringing it in the middle. But no problem, we can do it the other way, which is margin left. So maybe 100 pixels would be enough. No. 200. Near about. Okay, I think I need to treat it first. So again, we'll go with margin left. If you are confused, like we are treating this big div, which is the A div 
div as if it isn't rotated. So simply we can increase the margin to take it to the other side. So again, I know this much isn't required. Let's go for 50. No. 10. No, maybe 20. Yeah, 20 is the exact value. Most probably. Like we need to decrease the margin for the C div. So 190. 185 there is a slight difference maybe we have to rotate it a little bit more let's check 46 degree no maybe 44 okay let's first do a submit once and let's see how much difference is there okay it's a 99 percent match so we need to make a little bit change somewhere which just makes it exact like i think there is a slight value increase here I can be sure. Okay, what I'll do is I'll I put the difference on, so maybe put twenty-seven. Okay, so okay now it's ahead of where it should be. What else could be the problem? Like So maybe we have to change the height a little bit. Can't be sure. But that's a valid attempt. 29 no wait first i think we should get the sizes correct so Okay, we need to take it further on. So, 200, 300, 300 is what I've put already. So, 310, no, 305, then what, Okay, we also have to decrease the margin, supposedly. Now the only difference that remains is for this div. So we have to maybe change the value of left again, maybe 180. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, now it's more identical. 
like still there is a slight difference which even i can see but i can't understand why is there a slight difference like you can see these are the exact things maybe decrease the sizes a little bit for it like the height should go lower 97 98 99 91 92 93 94 95 96 97 98 99 maybe click off the okay let's try once again if it doesn't go to 100% now, then that's the end for the video. It even went lower. Duh. Wait. Bro. I was changing the wrong value and was expecting to get the right answer. Okay, so the value i have to change is this height 91 2 3 no 4 5 6 7 8 9 like when about 90 is the value at least same okay so my goal now is to take that b div to as accurate size as possible 101 101 is quite a lot perfect but according to it it isn't i don't know what's going on okay maybe now what we have to do is increase the width a little bit 102 and decrease this a little bit 6 5 4 okay i'm going in the wrong direction and i've realized it like is it the inner line yep ow 191, 192, 193, 194. Okay, so it's now going inside, which means it should be 189. Yep, and now we have to decrease this value. So now it has got even near, maybe 100. I'm expecting 100 now. No, still 99.9. .9. Okay, so that's it for today's video. Hope to see in the next one. Although I'll try to find the exact solution and I may show you in the next episode of this series. So stay tuned for watching the perfect solution for this. So, till then, bye.